Oh. He takes the money and he's like, and also let me leave evidence. You think you're better than me? Oh! <laughs> 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 Uh, good morning, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to Real Talk. Ooh, we have problems. Ooh, that reminds me of chlorine. Oh, yeah, this isn't good. I remember it's $4. Is that a peanut grigio? <laughs> no, smell it and think of like a community pool. <laughs> well, that doesn't make me want to drink this. <laughs> Welcome see. back, everybody. <laughs> it's Real Talk, baby. I am Brandon. I am Jordan. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for being here. And, um... We're gonna we're gonna take a look at cowbells today. Uh, one that you guys have requested and voted for on our Instagram. Uh, so yes, cowbells. We watched this before uh, when we were doing BJ versus the world, and we messed up the recording, right? But now we're coming. Well, I pretty much forgot everything that happened on this movie. So. I did too. I remember liking it. If you like it, uh, please give us a like. It really helps out the channel. Uh, helps us grow. And uh, thank you for all your wonderful comments. As always, uh, it always brightens our day. Uh, go uh, suggest a movie. We'll put it in the next poll. Also, uh, what's the word? Subscribe. That's the word. Uh, go subscribe, and uh, if you know you want to get notified when we hit, uh, fuck. I have a pun for this. Oh, hit the cowbell. <sighs> hit the notification cowbell. You took that from me. How does that feel? Oh man, it feels good. <laughs> <laughs> feels great. All right, Jordan's gonna beat me to death. Let's watch <laughs> cowbells. <laughs> yes, I am. Soup's on! <laughs> Soupy doop! <laughs> <laughs> this episode is starting off good. I uh, think that's why they were that's too sounding the bell. I think, you know... Because milk's on. I'll, I'll sleep on it, but I think so. It's Callum. Oh, one second. If you do not get off the phone and resume driving immediately, you will not get your driver's license. Okay. I don't care I'll... if you're going to fail. That's the thing, though. That's a responsible thing to do. I need to do that more often. Hand the phone over to the person in the passenger seat. I'll just hang up. Well, I know what you'll do. You'll put your thing up on the dash and watch YouTube while you drive. <laughs> I'm very aware of your driving habits, Brandon. Bro, don't out me. <laughs> that is something that literally happened yesterday. I was doing a bit, and it was our video. He was not doing it. you wanted bit. to watch it, too. I thought your New Year's resolution was to be nicer to me. And we're about a month in, and you've been meaner was in every way. Be nicer or meaner to me? It's always to be nicer. <laughs> every year, it's the same thing. It's so sweet, it makes it so hard to be mean to you. Let me just say this. If I don't pass today, I'm going to be back here every possible second. Requesting you and only you again and again. <clears throat> One second thought. <clears throat> oh, I don't want to be annoyed. <gasps> Go through. The, where he passes You're her? You're passed. Because of a mild annoyance of seeing you again. He understands that if he fails her. That right? means he only passes the best drivers and the worst drivers. Which is terrible. Because the worst drivers are going to keep killing the best drivers on the road. He should be in prison. Never once asked me for a favor. It's exactly my point. He didn't ask me, he asked you. And now I'm telling you, you're the one's going to teach his daughter to drive stick. That's not fair. Another guy from Vampire Diaries. Is he also from Vampire <laughs> yes, Diaries? Yes, he is. That's wild. Disney be like scouting for Vampire Diaries. I look. I I don't watch Vampire Diaries. Okay, first of all, you can't hide behind that because you have now made several Vampire Diaries references. Here, hold her a second. Hold this meat. <laughs> Future bacon. Goodbye. Bye, pretty bacon. Oh, you have little pre-bacons? We call them pigs. Pre-bacon. Sorry, that was offensive. Pre-ham. This one looks more like a ham. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to... Wait, is this the music one? Oh, let's hit them all. Oh, is this overstimulating? What is this episode? Now, ease off the clutch and give it some gas. You know, after watching, you know, time travel and, like, baseball and snowboarding, this is just such a more confined story. A little bit more realistic, maybe? More realistic than time travel and baseball, that's for sure. Yeah, anyone actually watching baseball for fun? Unrealistic. Two theories I can't get behind. The short boots, you've been combing the city for in lavender and baby blue. Why are we still here? 
grab your keys and your credit card. I'll get my phone. Whoa. <laughs> okay. They deserve to be cut off. Could you imagine just, let's go. In court, that's like first degree murder. They'd be like, you were trying to kill your dad who was asleep upstairs, right? Yeah. You threw the rag at the gas stove. And you got cut off like a day earlier. Well, yeah. And you took out a life insurance policy? It's Connecting like, the dots here. This, you, I, Wow. Thank uh, fuck it was I, I just, to that area. You should really be thankful. <laughs> the neighbors are alive. Count your blessings, dude. You burned my butterflies. <laughs> my butterflies are on fire. I got butterflies on my stomach, and they're hot. The firefighters are like, yeah, it, turned, it would have been fine, but those fireflies were so dry. It just like, whoa, just... Just blew up. You know, usually fires like this are fine, but because you're a weirdo <laughs> and have butterflies all over your house, the entire neighborhood is gone. I wonder if they're gonna spill milk everywhere. This is going in last if there ain't no milk spills. I'm expecting dairy conundrums. Lactose incidents. We have a lactose intolerant policy here. You guys are covered in lactose, and we're intolerant to that. Knock knock. Morning, Uncle Bob. Girls. Oh, you caught me red-handed stealing the milk money. Give me your milk money, nerd. <laughs> well, this is great. I won't what be able to read to, to my kids tonight. <laughs> we're all gonna stay late. Also, you know what? There's gonna be layoffs. And guess what? Guess who's gonna stay? You. Because you are here to learn a lesson. <laughs> I'm here because society has fucked me. I'm here because I love yogurt. I love, love it. <laughs> got a passion for yogurt, long hours, and I love packaging it. <laughs> you know how everyone's like, yogurt is famously the consistency you want to see every single day? She found it. Party Saturday night, Courtney. I'm so flattered you included us. Are you kidding? You guys are like my second parents. Heather oh. says gonna tell your other parents to give me a raise. It's been 25 years. <laughs> Actually gotten a pay decrease. <laughs> it's crazy. He said you're either laid off or 25% decrease in pay. I was like, well, I can't take the layoff. <laughs> my kids are already starving, sir. I like how this is an equal. <laughs> it's mutually beneficial. <laughs> He's like, it's a win-win, right? You keep your job. I save money. Maybe if you were truly stuck in the middle of nowhere, Brandon, maybe you do. At lunch, play the banjo. Maybe that's the move. The butter is churning. The yogurt is churning. The milk is churning. <laughs> my life is churning against my wishes. Will we go to heaven? I'm not sure. <laughs> Existential country. That's a new genre. Wait, but uh, this band's for real working folk. I think you'd be better off joining the pretenders. <laughs> Damn. Okay, now I'm on the, whoa. Now they're making me invested. Hey, this man Bro, was mean to me. I'm gonna drown you in the yogurt vat. <laughs> Murder is legal when you're a rich man. When it's in yogurt. Never <laughs> said anything about yogurt murder. Yogurt specific murders are hilarious and legal. Well, maybe if you moved a bit faster. Like it's not hard enough? You know what? Come They're on. about to get flack for spilling this blueberry mixture. It's, you can see the density. Like it's like, it seems like it's throwing yeah, the but equilibrium. Why off. isn't there a lid? Er, this should get you one step closer to that new patio. Uh, not this week. No, this one's going towards my daughter's braces. Oh, good one. <laughs> Do you have one for us, Mom? That so That's realistic. <laughs> uh, not this week. Dream's still on hold. Got a kid. You know, I did pick up those hours because, you know, my son turned six. He can run the farm now. <laughs> All by himself. You don't get paid unless you work an entire week. That's no fair. How am I supposed to buy nail polish and bubble bath? Yeah. <laughs> well, by putting that pretty little nose to the grindstone and keeping it there. This is the 99%. <laughs> you will not enjoy your stay. It's just braces, bills. <laughs> They'll be like, I would prefer... The chances of surviving Jurassic Park, more likely than surviving the 99%. There he is. <laughs> what 
What are you doing here? Slumming? Gliding through life without a clue? Rich folks love more than coming to the city and slumming it with the poor. Hamilton. Everyone go watch that. It's also on Disney+. Plus. Great, great musical. Brendan refuses to watch it with me. Isn't it like seven hours long? It is three hours long, and there's an intermission, Brandon. We can eat popcorn. We can talk about our days, you know? I only eat popcorn during the intermission. I cook it and then wait two hours. <laughs> then I go, yum! Okay, maybe we can do something else in intermission. I'm just saying we can fill the time. We can take a break. I feel like the intermission added time. That's weird. He left. Why is this in the trash? Oh, oh he's a dramatic con man. Oh he my. takes the money and he's like, and also let me leave evidence <laughs> in the trash. He took the money and then later that night he's drinking. He's like, you think you're better than me? <laughs> <laughs> Garbage. Oh, wow. You got me so good for a second. I thought you were serious. I am. Have you totally lost it? I can't do that. The girls and I are splitting all costs equally, the way it's but it always also done. also is her party, and she has an obligation to no, her friends. This that, is, this is a it's legit a conflict. No, it's a fun... It's a good conflict. It's this compelling. is a fun conflict. It's compelling is what I meant to it's say. It's a super Dick. fun... I like how fun this is. You this actual is testicle. Fun? Testicle boy. I'm That's, so heated. Situation <laughs> tough. You've done enough damage. Thanks. Frankly, I think this is what you wanted all along. My party's wrecked. Everybody will still remember yours the best. And it's just such a kid thing, because like $20,000 on a party, and that was just her portion. Ridiculous. That means it was at least sixty dollars to $80,000 for the entire party. I honestly might not spend $20,000 on parties my entire <laughs> life. Like, spanning my entire it existence. It doesn't cost that much. At every party. Yeah, every party, what, does it cost like 100 bucks? Three bottles of wine, some balloons, and renting a clown, of course. The making you know of a great party. You know what do you want? I brought you your check. I told you to mail it. I'm just holding these. wood. I don't know. I'm just, <laughs> I just chopped this. I just got out of the shower. <laughs> <laughs> you know, exfoliation. This kid's my thing. You know, I'm just saving time. Saving bears. Speaking of bears, watch the bear in the shower. Look at me. I'm a lumberjack. Just got done cooking dinner. He's just holding a bunch of denim pants. <laughs> Girls, what, what are you doing here? I wasn't going to make you come in today. Oh, but we want to go. You do? If we're at the dairy, that's eight hours a day. We can't be at the mall. Hmm? Well, that's a very good point. Let's go to work. Can I drive? Oh, God, that's what your kids are going to be like. <laughs> no, I hope so. I teach them right. <laughs> I come over to my house, and then they're going to wake me up at 4 a.m. and be like, why isn't breakfast ready? And I'll be like, what the hell is wrong with you? Dude, your kids and my kids... <laughs> Not going to vibe. It's gonna, fire and ice. <laughs> oil. Oil and water. Might like, be able to mix. My kids will be going to sleep when your kids are up. Reading the newspaper. Our lives are going to be a decom. Oh, they really Come are. Come to fruition. They really They're going to learn from each other. And we're going to be like, something bad is going to happen between us. That's going to make us. And we're going to reconvene at the end. Yeah. And they're going to be way better versions of us. I think we're gonna be the antagonist. We're gonna be the terrible dads, like all the decoms are. Yeah. Oh man, that's sucks. That's a lot to process right bummer. now. All right. All right. That was cowbells. That was um. It's always good. It's always a very heartwarming story. Every time. I like this. We've one. watched this a couple times now. Yes, we have. I feel like many, like three. This would be the third time. And this time, the recording worked out. So you know what? You yeah. finally get to see our thoughts on cowbells. Everyone's been waiting. It's been the long anticipated event. Yeah, uh, it's a good movie. I stand by it. I really like it. Love the message. I think uh, it's a great message. Thing. I think pretty good acting. Kind yeah. of a fun setting. Lo fi production. <laughs> Lo fi production. Well, you can't go wrong when you're talking about greed and money and just working hard and all that good stuff. Super fun. So let me throw this little opinion out there. I think right off the bat, I like this more than Eddie's million dollar cook off. I would agree. I think it's more based in reality. I Way can see more realistic. At a cooking farm. What? <laughs> I could see myself at a milk farm. Yes, at a. I it, could see it, myself. They usually call those dairy farms, but yeah. I could see myself birthing a calf. I could see myself driving a truck. You into would be a the pond. cowboy, always holding wood, coming out of the shower, pulling flint out your ass. Like that's just what you would do. Hey, what's up? I got wood. 
You are really bad at this dairy job. Denim jacket, denim pants, denim underwear. It's what I do. Can you put on a shirt, bud? Amazing. Terrible. Uh, Better than Eddie's million dollar cook-off. Better than Eddie's? Uh, Better than Lemonade Mouth. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that right now. I like this more than Lemonade Mouth. And we come to the high school musical wall. Okay. So, you know what, Brandon? I'm going to say something crazy now right is this now. Just, is this just out of fatigue jordan is this out of high school musical you know fatigue that we always hit this wall you know we can no. never surpass it this might be nostalgia <laughs> this might be my own biases but you know what we've said it once we i'll say it again our show our word is law <laughs> <laughs> okay i think it's better than high school musical one and two then one i think it's better than one for sure I will go out, you know, I will ride with you and say it's better than High School Musical 1. Have we broken the High School Musical wall and split them up? That's why I'm at the impasse. It's, it's right in between High School Musical 1 and 2. If you like, give us a like, please. <laughs> uh, go comment. Uh, make sure to suggest a decom because we uh, will uh, go through the comments and put it on the next poll for you to, yes. guys to vote on the Instagram. The poll is out. Um, please vote and... Uh, Vote on which movie you want to watch. We do this every Wednesday, uh, so then we know what to film throughout the week. Uh, subscribe if you like, and um, thank you all for watching. Hope you have a wonderful week. Have a have a have a wonderful week. I added to that. You, were, you elevated what I said. That I was really beautiful. did. I feel I felt like I came in clutch. Yeah, you didn't just say what I said. You <laughs> made it like better. I came in. I stole your uh, party money, and I saved the whole company. I think that's that what was I good. Just did. <laughs>